Here, we're getting a first peek at the Unreal Editor running in VR. This is not some special uh, experimental project. This is the Unreal Editor running in VR. So we should show how you can place some objects in the world. You can see we have objects in here. I can actually select them by just clicking my trigger. And kind of like a somewhat familiar transform gizmo appears where you can kind of grab and move things in kind of a traditional way. You can grab things freely with two hands. So this is kind of a new thing that you just can't do without motion controllers. Grab it with two hands and you can see like I'm just carrying it. Uh, you don't need to learn the user interface. You already know it. Your brain has been working this way uh, since you were a baby. Yep. You grab things, just make copies of them very easily. Just set it up here. So you're editing VR in VR. It's a completely what you, what you see is what you get experience. And so there's no question about what your game looks like. Right, this is amazing. So from a distance, you can see the outline of the UI. And you move it up close, you can read the text. You have the full Unreal Editor UI capabilities right there on your little virtual iPad in VR. You can see this is the real editor content browser. It's nothing fake. It's just the real uh, thing. And we have like basically just some meshes in the scene. Okay, so what you have is basically you've brought up the editor user interface as if it's a little iPad that you're holding in your hand. So uh, you deal with the UI in the way that you would deal with uh, if you were using the iPad in the real world. Yep. You're using the laser pointer to interact with it, to move it around. You can scroll it, you can click it. Uh, you can do anything. Now you've dragged a 2D object out of the content browser as a 3D object in the world. You can see as I drag it out, mm -hmm. it does lock to the ground, so it snaps to wherever you want to. With real-time real, real -time lighting, real-time shadows, it's all completely real-time, huh? Yep. Well, this is common. Um, you can stay tuned for GDC on March 16. Uh, we'll be showing this in more detail um, and presenting uh, the release plans for the Unreal Editor.